Comparing multi-digit decimals. In this lesson, we'll understand how to compare decimal numbers. To compare numbers, we always begin with the highest place value and compare the corresponding digits. The number with the greater digit is greater. If the digits are the same, move to the next place value and check again, and so on until you get a different digit. Take a look. We have 3 and 552 thousandths and 3 and 75 hundredths. Here the number of digits after the decimal in the two numbers are different. You know adding a zero to the end of a decimal number, as long as it is after the decimal point, does not change the value of the number. So let's add a zero to the end of 3 and 75 hundredths, so that the number of digits are the same. This will make it easier to compare the digits at each place. So now we have 3 and 552 thousandths compared to 3 and 750 thousandths. To compare the decimal numbers, first place them in a place value chart. Then we'll check the digits in each place one by one. Look at the ones place. The ones digits in both numbers are three. They are equal, so move on. Look at the tenths place. The tenths digit in the first decimal is five. The tenths digit in the second decimal is seven. Since five is less than seven, three and five hundred fifty-two thousandths is less than three and seven hundred fifty thousandths. Notice it doesn't matter what the digits are after the tenths place. Three and seven tenths will always be greater than three and five tenths. Now that we know how to compare two numbers, let's take a set of three decimals and order them. Order the following decimals from greatest to least. We have three and four hundred fifty-six thousandths, three and four hundred fifty-four thousandths, and four and twenty-eight hundredths. Follow the same approach as in the earlier problems. Look at each place value. Look at the ones place. We can see that the first two decimals have the same ones digit, which is a three. Four and twenty-eight hundredths, on the other hand, has a ones digit, which equals four. Since four is greater than three, we can say that four and twenty-eight hundredths is larger than the other two numbers. It is the largest number. Now let's compare three and four hundred fifty-six thousandths and three and four hundred fifty-four thousandths from the tenths place on. The tenths digit of the two numbers are both four. They're equal, so move on. The hundredths digits of the two numbers are both five. They are equal, so move on. The thousandths digit of the first number is six, and the thousandths digit of the second number is four. Since six is greater than four, three and four hundred fifty-six thousandths is greater than three and four hundred fifty-four thousandths. So in order from greatest to least, four and twenty-eight hundredths, three and four hundred fifty-six thousandths, three and four hundred fifty-four thousandths. Remember, to compare numbers, we always begin with the highest place value and compare the corresponding digits. The number with the greater digit is always greater. If the digits are the same, move to the next place value and check again, and so on until you get a different digit. Thanks for watching.